when removing fake reviews from Google Maps or Google My Business Listing, if you follow the insights I've shared with you and Google still shows that review, and then you're deciding to follow the insights for legal reasons, as in request removal for legal reasons, as I've shown to you in the previous video session. Now, imagine you came to this point and you're thinking, okay, what in the world does allegedly infringing URLs mean for removing fake reviews for Google Maps or Google My Business Listing? Here's what you need to place in here. Simply open up Google Maps. As you can see, the format of the URL should start with this or that. They are basically the same thing. Okay, that as you can see, they need to update their end too. So basically, press on google.com forward slash maps, go to Google Maps, search for your business, and press on the review count. Let's press on that. As you can see, the URL has changed. This is the allegedly infringing URL. So that's what you need to place in there when you're filling out this form to remove fake reviews from Google Maps and Google My Business Listing. Since that could be tricky in terms of since understanding what goes in here can be tricky, I've created this short video session, which is part of the previous video session, which can be found on Rank Your YouTube channel. I'm also going to maintain a blog post that may be of interest to you because I'm going to have a little bit more clear insights with images and so on. When you want to remove fake reviews that may be hurting your business results on the internet. I thank you for learning with Rankia and I'll talk with you in the next video session.